right we're checked in and waiting for our uh, call back so that we can go in and have some food at Olivia's Cafe super excited um, heard a lot of good things about their buttermilk chicken and mm -hmm. also they have prime rib on the menu yes, and, so um, conch fritters conch fritters yes conch fritters I want to try those tonight so. definitely so, sounds good I'm hungry I mean, we're in the keys you gotta have conch yeah let's go <laughs> I'm ready to eat <laughs> As of October 2021, this is what their current hours are. And brunch is served on Saturdays and Sundays. Super excited. Yummy. So they don't accept the photos anymore, but these are all DVC members of Old Key West Resort that have sent in their photos to decorate Olivia's Cafe. Some of them are really amazing. Look at that one, custom made with the buttons. So like the bad kids we are, we are in this room all by ourselves, which is why I'm showing you everything. But look at the decor in here. I'm telling you what, this is not too far off from what our house looks like with all these photos. <laughs> oh, they must have known that we were a nut for this kind of thing. But yep, here we are, off in our own little corner by ourselves because Apparently, we're naughty. <laughs> Probably. Okay, guys, our conch fritters have just arrived. Look how good those look. And, but even more important, <laughs> besides my handsome husband right there, look at my pina colada. And then you got something I forgot the name of already. The smoked turkey. The smoked turkey. <laughs> You're gonna like that, aren't you? Yeah. Can you hold that? Oh, we'll see. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Dink. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you. Oh, oh man. Oh, mine's nice and sweet. Mine's nice and smoky. There we go. Mm. That's real good. See, it's a good thing that we have very different tastes, guys, because we can tell you what's going to work depending on your palate. Because yep. <laughs> I would not like that. Probably not, but I do. <laughs> All right, Scott's bread and butter have arrived, and they are both dairy free. So if you do have allergies, they are very quick to accommodate. Um, he is going to go ahead and take a pill because there will be some cross-contamination with something that you're having. The I conch can't, fritters. All the conch fritters because they're fried mm -hmm. um, with the uh, uh, same fryer as the buttermilk chicken. So other than that, we're excited. All right, so I just had my first bite of the conch fritter. And if I'm not saying conch correctly, I apologize. Um, I haven't had anybody correct me yet, but it's basically like a little hush puppy, if you guys can see that a little bit. And um, it's really good. It's fried really well. And I like it with the spicy sauce. So that's the way to go. Um, they've also got like a, a mustard sauce, like what you would get with uh, pretzels and stuff up in Pittsburgh. Especially if you go to Permani Brothers, it's, it's that same mustard that you get with that giant pretzel from Permani Brothers. You go with the spicier sauce. It's much better. Heaven. I'm starting with him because it's not going to last very long. <laughs> Truly. He finally got his prime rib, guys. You've been craving prime rib for like 18 months. <laughs> I crave it every day. <laughs> so, very excited. That looks really good, actually. Mm -hmm. We got french fries instead of the cheesy au gratin potatoes. As you can see, I've had too much of that right now. 
good thing the food finally got here. And then I got the Southern Buttermilk Chicken. And oh my goodness, that looks so good. Ooh, look, there's even mashed potatoes underneath that. I'm gonna have a good time. All right, go ahead and eat. <laughs> okay guys, Scott is letting me have a piece of the fried rib. He's already dipped it in the au jus. I can't believe I'm getting to try this. I cannot wait, so let's see. I can't be believe that you let me have some of this. <laughs> it's terrible. You don't want it. I'll take it. No, no. You can have my chicken. No. Mm. Wow. That is really good, guys. Mm. Definitely. Um, honestly, the chicken or the prime rib, you cannot go wrong. So this is the main dining area of Olivia's Cafe. So you can see that this is really not a very big restaurant. They have so many amazing things in here. My favorite, being the fans. Isn't that amazing? appetizer for our lunch. Olivia's was so good we just had to come back, huh? Yes. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Can't wait to show you what else we got. Stop talking. I need to eat. <laughs> Alright, so what do you think? First look. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how I'm going to eat it. <laughs> it does look really good though. Yeah. And then I got the salmon. Super excited about that. <laughs> Dig in. Well, we absolutely loved our lunch at Olivia's Cafe, almost as much as we enjoyed our dinner. Of the two appetizers, whether it's the conch fritters or the crab cake, we personally liked the crab cake a little bit better, but that's gonna be your personal tastes. Uh, we are a sucker for really good crab cakes and it's one of the best that we've had. Uh, now, let's go ahead and uh, check out maybe the general store and see what we can get into in there. And then, of course, you've got the Conch Flats general store. Let's check that out. So there is our addition to our Christmas tree. Isn't that exciting? With this being a DVC resort, there is a lot of DVC specific merch, such as those DVC ears that you can see. <laughs> I didn't realize that they had Ewoks now. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, look at the Sporkies. Plenty of games that you can play with your kiddos. And then this entire section is DVC, which Scott kind of likes that. Maybe once we're DVC, I'll let him buy it. And in case you forgot your ears or you needed a new pair of ears because you can't have too many ears. I also have some of the Esmeralda from Hunchback of Notre Dame. Uh, Dooney and Burke bags and some Vera Bradley with this mini. Those are cute. 
I also really like these bags for Old Key West Resort because they have got that flat bottom so they won't fall over in the sand. Smart and classic Disney bags and luggage. Now this is also going to be where you can get some basic things for your room if you need them. Or if you have a sweet tooth, grab yourself a cupcake. We got the poison apple cupcake right now. Interesting. And just some more goods for your room if you needed some snacks or bread, things like that. You also got a pretty decent selection of swimmers and pull-ups and stuff here. Other things for your baby. Other snacks. Now I will say, I really like this kitchen section right here because, look, they've got Mary Blair Alice uh, towels. Aren't those cute? And then of course your aprons for when you are cooking. Here's some more Old Key West merchandise. It's actually a really nice cup right there. And I do really like that as well. The beach towel. Not that we need another beach towel. I was already told by the kids that if I brought another cup home that they were going to murder us. Well, guess what? We're bringing two. Oh, look, here's some marble bags. And this was the top shop for resorts in 2015. I can see why. They've got a lot of really nice things in here. They've even got some fine jewelry as well and watches. Of course, you cannot forget your H2O products. Let's see, they've actually changed the shampoo and conditioner bottles, which is just fine. And then these are very popular. We saw those in the parks all over yesterday. And then here's a very nice spirit jersey. Okay. Of course, you gotta have pens and pencils. And then here's some other ornaments. <laughs> That's cute. Mickey with the cell phone, her with her Mickey bar. I like that. And then other Christmas ornaments as well. You have to look up. Because look at all of the amazing details they have. Even the fans. Beautiful. Well, unfortunately, that's going to wrap up our video. We had so much fun exploring and having fantastic food at Olivia's Cafe at Old Key West Resort. We also, also had probably a little too much fun shopping, if you know what I mean, but that is definitely a fun shop to get yourself lost in uh, if you're needing to spend a little bit of time before you get on the buses or uh, if you're just a shopaholic like we are. So we hope that you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so already. Also hit that bell notification button and also like this video if you've enjoyed it. Look forward to seeing you again on our future videos. Make sure that you keep an eye out and hit that bell notification button so that you see when we put out our pool video for Old Key West Resort. And with all that being said, are you ready for your next Plum Crazy adventure? Because we're ready to get you there.